guys, it's Evie and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a video in which I am going to be trying to do some Pinterest hairstyles. I'm really bored of having the same hairstyles. Like, I literally do not switch it up. I would love to try out some new stuff. So I've picked about seven-ish pictures from Pinterest of different hairstyles, all of which have the same, like, kind of hair type as me. So I'm going to go ahead and try them out. I really do hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a massive thumbs up if you do and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Without further ado, we're going to go ahead and get started. Let me give you a bit of a rundown. So my hair is currently very frizzy. I literally straightened it last night. I don't know what has kind of happened here. I'm going to put a picture on the screen so you can see like what the hairstyles look like and then we're going to see if I can recreate them. Hairstyle number one. We're starting with a bit of a challenging one for me. I can't lie. Like a very like pancake pushy push bushy i meant bushy voluminous dutch pats and she just kind of pulled bits out of the sides i feel like dry shampoo is going to be needed to just like give my hair a bit volume and also i have a sty again why do i keep getting styes it's actually kind of boring now i've got myself a parting brush and some clear elastics because i feel like that's what we'll be needing today is that parting good she's done them kind of like to the side a little bit so i think i'm going to start doing them to the side how much this makes my arms hurt shove a hair tie on it she had loads pulled out the sides i probably should have taken a bit out before um it doesn't really look good hers was like so loose yeah mm, Ooh. let's move on to the other side this is the other one i can't actually see what it looks like you're probably looking at it, like throwing up this is where we're at do you know what it doesn't look as bad as i thought it would the pieces that i chose to pull out are questionable this is what the back looks like if i could like pull out the right bits and like make them a bit neater then i would give it like a solid like seven out of ten i do really like it and i feel like plaits are a vibe for like summer and stuff do you know what? i'm gonna up that to a 7.5 my rankings are all about the hairstyles on me by the way i'm kind of putting together like the effort it takes what it looks like on me etc Hairstyle number two, I could have just left the tops of these plaits in. I want to make them better. I want to try and improve my skills. Basically, hairstyle number two is kind of like a beach vibe. Your classic Dutch plaits into a nice little messy bun. It's actually going to be quite a big section, but I'm not going to be plaiting the whole head. I'm just going to tie this like here because it's just going to go into a bun anyway. Now, I don't know whether there's a plait on the other side like it's her side profile i guess i'll just do one plait i've actually done that quite well this bun is not going to be like a really neat one i'm going to try and make it look a bit like carefree but i am going to pull out these little side bits now she has a lot of side bits coming out it's very messy looking but like nice messy wait i kind of like this i think i've done this before for like sig form actually but this one looks kind of good i think it would look better if i had another plait here because it's just like so loose but i really like that this gets a solid eight out of ten if i had a plait on the other side i love it hairstyle number three this one is definitely like the simplest one so it's literally just straight hair with a white headband now i did have a white headband but i don't know where it is so i'm just going to be using a like a beigey one but just pretend it's white i'm just heating up my straighteners so i'm going to straighten my hair Look how much better it looks than how it looked before. I don't know why I didn't just straighten it at the beginning of this video to help with the frizz. Where is the headband? Literally just on her head and then slightly on her forehead. I love this because I love it when my hair's not in my face. I kind of like this. I would give this like a 7.5 out of 10. Okay, hairstyle number... I don't even know what number it is. I found one of two girls with claw clips. I've been trying to sort out my claw clip game for ages. I literally cannot make claw clips look good. Now, they both have straightened hair, which is great because I just straightened mine. So, I'm basically just kind of going for, like, something similar to both of them. They both have two bits out of the front. And we're going to section off our front bits first. Now, because they're straightened, hopefully they'll look better. Taking my two bits out. It looks like this girl's, like, folded it up and then down and up again. But my hair's not not that long let's do it like this so you really can't see with this one but i'll show you when i've done it how does that look i literally cannot see how that looks i literally can't see i mean i love a claw clip so i'm gonna give this one a solid eight out of ten it's just a vibe next hairstyle she basically has the two bits at the front which are curled and then a curled ponytail we're gonna try and make this work okay not parted back here either so i'm just gonna pull all this back tie it up the top we're gonna curl it because obviously the girl in the picture has her hair curled. Okay, 
My arm is aching like no other. Now, I always get really scared like putting heat in my fringe because I just feel like I'm going to burn it off. Because Wow, that looks so good. It doesn't really look like a picture. I wish my hair held curl because I love how that looks. Okay, do you know what? I think the fringe bit was meant to be like a lot more of a light curl, like literally just at the end, just like that. I did it. Oh, okay. It could look better, but it looks better than it did a few minutes ago. She did also take a little bit of hair and wrap it around the hair tie. That looks so much better when you put the thing around it. The fringe bits just aren't really vibing. I'll give it a solid 8.5 out of 10. I think it's so cool. The final hairstyles, basically, I've seen, so I'll show you both pictures that I got, so just like normal braids, and then braids with like the beads going throughout, and I really want to try the ones with the beads, because I've never tried it before. I recently got all of these. Can anyone tell me why it smells like rubber burning? I'm gonna do a few normal plait stitches. I think what you do is you basically just put it through one of your plait stitches. But how am I meant to do it without dropping everything else? What? If I just wet this piece of hair, that is not going through. Guys, I am so confused. Guys, you know what? I think my issue is that my beads are too small. And I do have these beads, which have way bigger of a like circumference whole thing. Wet this piece of hair again. Then we're gonna thread it through the bead. Now this bead is way bigger, so it shouldn't be as much of an issue to just, there we go. We just keep plaiting. Oh my gosh, I actually love how this looks. This is such a summer vibe, you know? Okay, I'm gonna thread on this finishing bead and then I'm gonna finish the plait. Okay, update. That took forever. I did another one, but it just looked like I had to finish it really early because one of the pieces was so small and it's very messy looking. The concept of it I really like and you'd get faster at it. This one's definitely a lot better, but like it does look really cool and it's really good for summer. Do you know what? I'm going to give it a solid 8 out of 10. It's a cool concept. It just takes a while to do. Thanks Pinterest for this lovely idea. That is the end of this trying Pinterest hairstyles video. They're all the hairstyles that I'm going to try today. I can't lie, my arms are aching, but it was fun to try out some new hairstyles get some hairstyle inspo hopefully gave you some inspiration too very much hope you enjoyed this video do let me know any video requests down below because as usual i'll be surprised i am stuck for video ideas so any video ideas that you have would be very appreciated i will see you in my next video bye